Hell's fire. She's coming. Hello. I don't know much about you. I don't remember your issue. Other than you're packed. Hello. Who are you? Dude, well, I need to see Midriff. You've been naughty. Mizora. And you know what happens when you're naughty. God damn it. Anyone but her. You know her? Just who in the nine hells are I? Well, well, aren't you a luscious thing? God's damn devil, get out of my camp. Hey, I've got a clean face. Well, you absolute stinker. You kept me a secret. Hmm. Time to let the Hellcat out of the bag. Call me Mazora. I'm Will's patron, the fount of his power. My pet's been unruly, and his leash needs a yank. Oh we had dear. A deal, Will. Oh dear. Carlac still breathes. She's the I've source. Taken more pleasant shits than you, Mazora. And at least those can be buried after. That's no kind of talk for a lady. By the way, Karlak, Zariel sends her regards. You told me! Devils only! She's a tiefling, not a monster! How precious. The little pupster's found his bar. Uh -huh. Clause G, section 9. Target shall be limited to the infernal, the demonic, the heartless, and the soulless. And she's Karlak infernal. The criteria oh. By virtue of having no heart. Oh. She does have a heart. It's just mechanical. Get to the point, devil. What do you want? If we kill Karlak now, will I get rid of you? You better not lay a damn finger on Karlak. Blast it all, Will. Why don't you tell me about her? I've heard enough. You're not leaving this place alive. How on earth are we going to solve this conundrum in the long term? He can't lose his patron. Get to the point. What do you want? The point? Oh, yes. Thanks for the reminder. You're welcome. Oil burns in the fires of Avernus. Uh. The lightning storms of Dis strike his flesh. Ooh. His soul passes through each layer of the hells, gaining their essence. Well. And their torment. Oh. must be horrible what is that permanent what the hell what the hell that's better what the hells have you done the promise broken a price paid you know the terms get used to the new form pet there's no going back some magic even I can't undo. Now, let's see how the frontiers fare without their precious blade. Karlak, keep an eye on him, would you? I'll be keeping mine on you. Oh, and Will, don't forget, our pact still stands. Ta-ta. Uh, I'm sorry, my door has just dropped in absolute shock. <laughs> I'm, I'm sure you expected more words from me, but I'm, my mouth was just open like, what the hell's happening? Oh my god. Um, he now looks like a demon. Congratulations, Will. <laughs> That's gotta hurt. I'll be honest, soldier. I'm really. So am I. Will hardly knows me, but he chose my life. Well, I don't think his. he considered you to fit been a long time since someone stuck their neck out for me like that. I mean, that's sweet and all, but I genuinely don't think that he thought that you fit the bill. Because I think Missouri is splitting hairs on the fact that you don't have a heart, because technically you do. So you don't fit into the category that breaks his pact, which I didn't even know what his pact was, but now I do. Uh, so, yeah. Uh, he's a good man, maybe the best of us, though he's gonna be having some psychological issues now. You can say that again. When he was chasing me through a Vernus, I thought he was just another sad merc. How wrong I was. Are you gonna help him with his problem? Or promise to help him with his problem? I cannot wait for that sound to go away. Will? 
I'm sorry? I didn't realize there'd be repercussions to keeping Karlak alive. That was Lazelle. God, I couldn't recognize her for a second. Gods damn her straight back to the hells. Just look at me. I did what was right. Damn straight you did. Mazora made me pay. So just l live I'd loud and proud. Devils and demons, she said. Traitors and hypocrites, heartless evils of all sorts, but not, not Zariel's victims, not innocent yeah. tieflings. Yeah. So live proud. Well, parents tend to be unforgiving from hey. what we know of them. Will was lucky he didn't face a more severe punishment. I think, embrace it. Do you look not that great? Yes. But you are in the right. Your heart stands pure. And I think there's value to that, even if you look a little different. You want to be about Raphael, but are pacted to Mazora. What a what? Oh, God. The Battle of Front Later Frontiers has some explaining to do. What did you expect? She's a devil, hardly the paragon of honesty. You've been turned into a devil, an appropriate punishment, I'd say. You're lucky she didn't take your soul when she came. This seems the tamest response. I'll say what I can. But it won't be enough. I'll take what I can get, thank you. It's Mazora who grants me the power you to think? conjure armor and cast Eldritch Blast. Yes, blasts. I got that, thank you. How, I though? Infected. I could even call hell beasts and summon festering clouds, but I promise you. Nice! Every thrust <laughs> of my blade and every flame I sparked was for the good of the coast. Oh, I don't disagree. I actually never questioned that. Your arms are a little skinnier than I imagined, though, <laughs> underneath your shirt. What are the terms of your pact? You should get out of this pact. How in the hell did you get involved with Mazora? Ah, the one little question that put me out of house and home. I can't utter the terms or circumstances of the pact. Ah. I can tell you most all else, but the pact, I'm forbidden. Well, we learned some of it. it. But I'll say this. The moment I pacted myself to Mazora, I have not regretted for a heartbeat. It was my proudest deed. Because it's allowed it you. Yes. Mm -hmm. All I can mm -hmm. give you on that is my solemn word. He's made the pact to give him the powers to do good for the coast. A dangerous thing to do, but as he says, he doesn't regret it. So I can't make him feel guilty for that. Well met. Well met. How does it feel to be a devil? It's said that anyone who bathes in the river of blood emerges as one born anew. It's a lot like that, I imagine. Very poetic. I feel the weight of these horns on my head curling upwards like a mammoth's tusks. I feel these ridges snaking down my neck. Yeah, I did notice Not those. to mention a few bumps and prongs and your cheeks in unmentionable are a little... places. <laughs> but I haven't seen my reflection just yet. Oh, please don't. Be my mirror. What do you see? I see a man... Proud on the decisions that he's made and still pure of heart. Uh, what are my actual options though? <laughs> Quite the handsome devil if I do say so. A freak of nature. Gods, but you're hideous. I see Blade of Frontiers, no more and no less. A fiend who's been touched by the hells. I don't know what to make of it. Oh, I like two of those options. Shit. You know, I came into this game with a very, I don't know if I said this already, whether I was just thinking it, with a clear perception of who I was going to romance. For those who don't know, it was Halzen. I was going to get some bear action and it was going to be great. However, I've been quite turned by both Shadowheart, Gale, and Will. I find them all lovely and I wouldn't mind romancing any of those three. But now that this happened, i got to admit, Will's a little more intriguing. Just a little bit. So, uh, I don't know if he's going to take this quite the way I mean it because I'm focusing on Devil. Or whether I should just be more upfront about I see you as you are. Which honestly is the most heart-to-heart -heart response I think I can get. Whereas this kind of feels more flippant. But I don't know which way he'll take it is my problem. <laughs> I can't tell if you're being silly or serious. Serious? I'll accept the flattery either way. <laughs> I suppose I'll grow used to the new me. Horns and all. Yeah, why not? The people will see a curiosity. Maybe even a beast hungry for their souls. But I will slay their monsters. Keep them safe. And one day they will see the Blade of Frontiers again. Why can't you? Is there any reason why you can't be the Blade as a devil? It doesn't stop you from doing your job. 
You should get out of this pact. I don't know about that. I'm gonna save that. I don't want to ruin this. But, I mean, it's a conversational game, but I probably should follow. But, as we said, he doesn't regret his decision. So telling him that he should get out of it, I don't think he's gonna take this well. A possibility that's oh, okay. kept me awake countless nights. But I don't have a clue where to start. Are we actually going to pursue this? And play by the rules. Let's do this. That's the only language devils Let's get Will out of his pact. Why obey her at all? What could she do that's worse than you or oh, honey? That she, she can do many worse things. Can't we just attack her the next time she pops up? There must be some loophole in the contract that lets you out. There could well be. She has the blighted thing. How do I get it? What I know of it is simply what has engraved itself upon my memory. My contract is very clear. I can bring Mazora no harm. She'll have to let me out of my pact willingly. That sounds very difficult. The only way out is if I can out-bargain her. We're standing here with nothing but the clothes on our backs and the worms in our heads. Is the any way we could leverage Raphael and Mazora against each other. God, that sounds like a dangerous game to be playing. Very, very dangerous. Because I do not want to lose my soul to Raphael. But, devils like their games. We can beat her if we put our worms together. <laughs> uh. We can. I'm sure of it. How glad I am that you see me as more than my patron's pet. You are more than your patron's pet. You need to see yourself as more than... I suppose he does see himself I'm as more than that. I think he's just glad that other people see the same as well. I always forget, how do I see... Character sheet, that's it. Hey! Hey, 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 oh, Carlock, yeah, I need to go talk to you, hey. Okay, we're doing well, we're doing well. Yes, that's great. Can I can I interact now? Is he just uninteractable? I broke will. Oopsies. I broke will. Uh uh. Heading out. Uh Karlak? I broke will. Time for a chat. What's the story? Yeah. Oh, I was Will. Oopsies. That's on me. I forgot that I was clicked on him. I want to talk about your infernal engine. Old Rusty? Sure. Uh, how did you end up with such a contraption in your chest? The year? Ten air. Okay. The place? Sleepy little town called Baldur's Gate. Oh, you did get in Baldur's Gate. Our hero, Karlak, a not knee delinquent from the outer city with everything I thought you give, got it in the hells. You got it in Baldur's I was Gate? I kid looking for a way to fill my days and make some cash when I fell into the wrong crowd worked for a guy I respected a lot turns out the feeling wasn't mutual I'm sorry through the jigs and the reels he made a deal with Zariel behind my back you know Zariel right archdevil yeah of Avernus. I got that she put this thing in my chest oh she did okay I was right but to war I learned quick how to stay alive and the engine served me when it came to killing devils ten years of that the stories I could tell. You mentioned a boss who gave you up to Zariel. Who was it? And can we go get revenge? Guy named Gortash. Gortash. Politician. Inventor. One of these wheeler well, dealer types who seems to have a finger in every When we get to pie. Act 3, we'll find him for you. I guess I was naive to think everything he got up to was above board. I mean, yes. What did I were. know? I saw a job. A good job. With people I liked. Doing work I was good at. Hmm. Sometimes I'm jealous of that girl. Hmm. Oh, to feel so invincible again. But that would have you be naive again. In your expert opinion, what is the best way to kill a devil? That seems like a strange thing to ask. Depends on the type. Ice devils hate an inferno, but that's an easy one. Orthons love projectiles. What they don't love is getting their bombs lobbed right back in their faces. 
Demons, on the other hand, every demon is absolutely singular. You can't ever think you've got them typed out. Sharp instincts, sharp weapons, and a knack for improvisation. That's the only way to survive them. <laughs> anyway, what are we talking about? Yeah, no, I, I, I love your passion for your job. Now that those paladins are out of your way, what's next on your agenda? Following, f finding Gortash? I can help you with that. First things first, I need to get this engine Yeah, we'll get to the Druid's Grove. Things powerful, but it's been feeling volatile ever since I left the Hells. You think? It can't be too hard to find an infernal mechanic around here. <laughs> You're funny. Uh, this isn't where I thought I'd end up. How about you? <laughs> funny you should ask. I was just thinking about what would have become of us without that Nautiloid. I mean, mm. I know where I'd be. Trapped in Avernus still, with the Blade of Frontiers on my tail. But what about you? I have no idea. I'd be back in my home, not a care in the world. I'd be in the middle of another adventure, blessedly free of any tadpole. So much has happened, I can barely remember what life was like before the abduction. Mm. I can picture you getting mixed up in some outrageous shit. <laughs> Giants, <laughs> beholders, <laughs> Thayans, the works. It's a bit dramatic for me. Maybe once we've wrapped up the current shenanigans, we'll rest a bit and find some new heap of troubles to throw ourselves hey. at. Hey, yeah. Let's do that. Anyway, I am so sorry, Will. I can actually talk to you and not have you talk well, to yourself. <laughs> uh, okay, I've exhausted your, your avenue. Gail, you're still alive, right? Everything. Yeah, great. I don't think Shadowheart has anything else to offer, but we're going to go better. say hi nonetheless. Oh, Shadowheart. Almost pleasant traveling with company. Yeah, you already if told you me that. ignore all the less pleasant aspects. Never mind, I'm good. Um. <sighs> Every time I look at this, it makes me want to just hurl. I just, ugh. It's revolting. It's just going to... Mm. I have no one to sell it all to is the problem. Road dust grey clothes. Yeah! Oh, I don't know about the shoes, though. Nice. Matches your hair. I quite like that. Otherwise, we've got some scruffy vagabond clothes. Ooh, a bit of green. <gasps> That'll match your eyes. Oh, actually... I think this other one matched your hair a little nicer. I need some better shoes for you, though. Oh, I don't, I don't know about your shoes, dear. I don't have much to pick from, unfortunately. I sold all the rest I had. More's the pity. Will. What would you look like in this? Because I, I don't know about what you're wearing. I mean, it's not bad. I'm just... It's just... Ugh. That is positively disgusting. I apologize. Earthy garb. Lol. Turn back to Nevea. Nevea. Oh, yeah. Read and send back to Nevaeh. She's in a camp. Is that even worth anything? <laughs> no. I'm a twit. Yeah, I don't... I don't know that I vibe with any of that. But Still my really options are not great. Everything. Considering they look like each other. So his is just going to look like a grey version of that. So that's not going to work. What about homely clothes? Defender of the people. What do your homely clothes look like? I kind of like that more. I don't know. I mean, I just don't like seeing men's midriffs. If you were shirtless, I would be fine with that. There's just something about just showing that little bit of midriff that just, I don't, I don't vibe with that at all. I really don't. Bear with me and wear that for a bit, okay? I'll find something else for you later. Maybe, if we're lucky. If not, you're just gonna have to wear that for all eternity. I may just change my mind and give you your OG shit back, but until then. I'll give up now. Okay, I've just sorted everything, put it where it needs to be, added to wares for both myself and Karlak. Uh, I think we are good to rest for the evening, even though there are only four bed rolls and we have more than four people on the board, well, collectively in the party. Let's rest. Oh, he wishes to speak with me. 
No one's got an exclamation point over their heads. Who wishes to speak to me? Oh, Withers does. I have something to ask. Hey, Withers. Not this one. Nor this one. And this one are less worthy still. Can I help you, Withers? Uh, what are you doing? Writing the balance. Okay. Beyond mortal realms, there doth exist an amalgamation of spirits akin to thine own, ensnared by the treacherous cult of the Absolute, felled in its name. They bear great discontentment with their destiny. Okay. For a mere pittance of coin, I might summon ah, the worst among them gotcha. to lend aid to thy undertaking. Um, will these hirelings be joining me willingly? Do you think I can trust these cultists? Suspicion always haunts the guilty mind. Ha. My services are all that I can proffer thee. What thou wilt do with them is for thee to undertake. They're going to be silent people. I, at least my companions are useful. Um, will they join me willingly? Most willingly, forsooth. Their passions doth run deep for what hath been wrought upon them. Okay, thank you. I still think I need to fix the broken parts of my class, but I guess I'll ignore that. Alrighty, auto select. Forest. Oh, I'm having a restless night apparently, and yet I'm fine. Scratch is here! Will, 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 will. Scratch, scratch, scratch game. Oopsies! Scratch, <laughs> come back. My apologies. Hope you're keeping well, friend. And you too, buddy. I'm sorry about what happened to your master. Master. Friend. I stayed with him until... Until I knew he was gone. I'm sorry. I'll never forget him. But I'm glad to have met you. Yay! Will has a new friend. Pet him. Who's a good boy? You don't seem worried about my demonic uh, presence? Sorry, devilish. I must make the distinction because there is a distinction. I want to pet you too, Scratch. You're not a cat, but you know, we'll take what we can get. Who's a good boy? Oh, so everybody approves when I do it. <laughs> Yay, easy way to get approval. I'm going to assume I don't get more approval if I, if I do it a second time. Yeah, thought so. He got some love. That's so cute. Anywho, we're going to go to the Druid's Grove. Unfortunately, it's a long way I have to walk to get in. Oh, is that not the place I want to be? No, this is it. Do you think they're going to react differently to Will's appearance? Or do you think they're not going to concern themselves overly much with that? I don't know, but the bodies are gone. Just, you know, nice change of pace. <laughs> no, I never noticed before. They actually have to go around and get the gate. I, I'm sorry. Thank you. Let's get on with it. Is that blood? Don't mind me. No, never mind. D Swift as my feet can carry me. Now, Aaron will not have gained extra currency, will he? Might have to go seek well. Damon. Need anything else? Of course. But please, remember. Oh, oh he's got extra need. coin on him. Yes. 
his, have his items changed? Uncommon medium armor. Gain a plus one bonus to dexterity, saving throws, and checks. I'm sorry, but Will only wears light armor, the bastard. Right? Yeah. He only wears light armor, unfortunately. So, that's not going to work. And I just gave uh, Shadowheart the 14 AC, even though it looks really good. And I didn't need any of the other things you offered, and I don't even, I don't even need that. Could be useful, but it's just so situational, you know. Do you have light armor? Well, there you go. Padded armor plus one. Hey, you're going to look right stupid because the red suits you immensely, but increased UAC. You will thank me for that. Except... I need to be the one bartering for it. Um, increase the dexterity saving throws. Elixir of Bloodlust. And you gain an additional... Once per turn when you kill a foe, you gain five temporary hit points and an additional action. Damn, that's interesting. Do you have any more potions on offer? Of healing? I do feel that I should be stocking up on those bad boys. Oh, I can't add my wares. Eh, shit. I'd have to get out of bartering. Ah, oh, but well, we're here now. Now, you know what? I don't have the patience for this shit. Just give me... Um, that. Thank you. And... What was the other thing I picked up? Oh, the healing potions. Healing potions. I'll take all those, thank you. And then I sell all my wares to you. And boom, I'm rich. Uh, Karlak, if you could be so kind. Nice. You need to give me your money though. Oh, it's just accumulated wealth. Okay, that's fine. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. That will have to suffice. I'm feeling significantly lighter. Sylvanas be with you. Thank you. I'm so glad that you restocked your currency. I greatly appreciate the Jesus. Appreciate that. Um, Carla, can you please? I'll be taking that, thank you. What am I to do? You don't have any gold. Sharp as ever. You have fifty-six gold. Alright. There we what go. Now? Okay, and then you give this to Will. Where am I needed? Will begrudgingly puts it on. Oh my god, that looks repulsive. Ew. Ew. Never a dull moment. Hi. Need anything you still else? die, don't you? Of course. But please remember. Die? You're not the of only the one red variety? Muddy red? I mean it's better than not muddy red. Problem is I don't know how to use it. No, just the freaking one. Do they just come as a pack? Thank you. How do I Sylvanas use you. it? And you, sir. Can you give that to Will? Defender Can you people. apply that to that? How do I combine? with that. This is a new system. I've never seen this before. What does that button mean? I don't know. Great! Looks better already. Fantastic. There we go. We've got a very red-based team. <laughs> a very dark team as well. In fact, we could probably work on your colouring, Shadowheart, if you want your purple back. No. I've got a long I just... Ahead. We'll leave it as is. Did you have You're something welcome. else you had to proc as a daily thing? There was that. The familiar's already here, so you don't need to worry about that. Yep, okay. I think that's all you needed to do. Oh, or should we be doing the armor of Agathus? 
No, because then you'd lose a hex. No. No, 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 no. I needed two hexes because if you lose concentration, we're fucked. Still alive? Yeah. So that's progress. It is! Let's go see Damon. Be on my way. I'm pretty sure that was the gentleman's name. I feel like we should get Will to talk to the kids and see how they can scare them. <laughs> uh, I don't mean. Why are you. What was the point of going that way, you twit? Um, I think Karlak may have to be the one to speak to you, Damon, but I'm going to instigate conversation nonetheless because that's how I roll. Thought I sensed an inferno around here. But you aren't from Elturel. What's your story? I spent a good bit of time in the house. Enlisted against my will by the Archdevil Zariel. Same as you, I suppose, if you're from Elturel. The devils were delighted when your city was swallowed up. I thought they had you for keeps. Glad you got out. I got lucky. It looks like you did too. And... You brought some infernal machinery with you. A little gift from Zariel. Keeps me burning hot. Very hot by the smell of it. Might be burning out a piston ring or leaking oil. Mind if I take How a does he access it? You'd have to open her flesh, would you Don't not? Don't get too close or your eyes will melt shut. You really are burning up. Whoever put that engine together tried to house metallurgized demono valves inside a Ragnax alloy case. Very risky. I might be able to help. I'd need infernal iron. And a prayer that my hammer will survive the work. <laughs> that thing infernal isn't iron. meant to operate outside of Ernest. I'm not sure how much longer it'll keep running the way it's going. Will you be able to turn down the temperature a little? Worried I'm gonna go in for a handshake and singe someone's arm off one of these days. I'd worry about surviving the night first. But help one, help both. If we can cool you off, it'll stabilize your engine and allow you to touch whomever you please. She likes that prospect. Okay, well, where can I look for the Infernal Iron? I've sensed some during our travels. A location? It has a, a pull to it. Because this is all new. We have not done this in early access. Once you know what you're looking for. Okay. I can show you where Please. I am. Please. Yes. Um, we'll keep our eyes open for some iron. Meanwhile, I've still got plenty of weapons and armor in stock. Thanks, Damon. Uh, you pretty much just got what I sold to you. Anything new? Got the same stuff that I've seen before. Just purchased all that. Oh, there's the red dye. Nah, Will's fine in his muddy red. <laughs> muddy red. And that didn't do anything extra except for the saving throw. Yep, nah, we'll just leave um, Shadow Heart with her shitty wooden shield. Oh, 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 what about that? Battle axe. No, wait, hers does D10s, doesn't it? 12, sorry. Hers does a D12. Why is that a 1D8 in brackets plus 4? A weapon enchantment plus one. What's the difference? Oh, she's a great axe. That's the difference. I comprehend. Okay, so we need to find great axes for her. And then you would do less damage because your morning star does d8. Yep, nope, that makes perfect sense to me. You know, I'm tempted to dip you into a level of, like, Paladin or something, or just to get you into heavy armor. That's nothing I can do at this moment. You know, you probably would look prettier. How do I get you to move? I can't. If you wore something like that. Oh, it's a chain shirt. What about that? Put you in some hard. <laughs> it tanks your AC, though, which just defeats the whole purpose. Forged from the heart. Thanks, Damon. What I, wouldn't do for better tools. I don't know that I can help you on that front. So... Show on map. Have to burn them. It's somewhere back in the Blighted Village. Okay. I mean, I had other priorities, but... I guess I can do that. Which way's north? 
this way. So it's in here. Do you think I have to kill these guys to get it? Or do you think I can just get in I'll through the door? Oh, hold on. It might be downstairs. I didn't think about that. Oh my. Okay. A pleasurable deal of the I'll shocking truth. Used old key. Where did I get that from? I'm going to read that immediately. Below is a transcript of an interview with the writer and director of A Pleasurable Deal, Mr. Kingsley Harp. Interviewer, what was the inspiration behind this, if I may be so bold, entirely lewd piece of drama? It's about exploring the taboo, seeing who we are as people really are. Yes, Robert makes a deal with a cambion, but who wouldn't? Well, I like to think most people wouldn't. Then you don't know most people. Everyone wants something. Everyone needs something. Cambians can see it. If, in a way, they know us better than we know ourselves. But at the end of the play, Robert dies horribly. What does that say about we, as you put it? About what we, as you put it, need? You forget, Robert dies because he broke away from Carlisle. He didn't stay true to the deal they made. So you're encouraging people to make a pact with Hell's offspring. To give up, as Robert did, his soul. We only have one life. Why not make the most of it? So, what was your deal? I beg your pardon. In fact, this was your directorial debut, wasn't it? You couldn't even get published in the tabloid, Baldur's Bash, before this play came out. Did you honestly trade your soul for an erotic play? Uh, all right, we're done here. <laughs> uh, we really don't need that on us. What's inside? I like how the interviewer caught on to that immediately. Uh, no, there's no point in even taking that. I'm about to start getting very particular about what I take from things rather than just taking everything. I'm so sick of increasing my inventory slot unnecessarily. So it's got to be in here somewhere, does it not? Looks empty. Yeah, fair. Okay. Uh, I think it's telling me... Oh no, it's up ahead. Okay, okay. So it, hopefully it is down here. Or up there or something. Look, Will's blind. Give him all the help you can get. Did you suddenly gain dark vision, by the way, in, in, in Turning Infernal? No. No, he didn't. That's okay. I shouldn't have wished to live in more interesting times. I'll go there in a sec. Let's just finish in this direction first. You never know what could be hiding. I don't really need this many thieves tools because they don't seem to break like I think they're supposed to. Or get used up as I think they're supposed Let's to. See. Waiting to get into combat, to be honest. The approachable is to send a camp. There's a trap. <sighs> and we still never got anything to disarm to the damn things, did we? I don't believe... Oh, you do have some! Yay! I need to fix your stats, girl. I think I need to get you into, like, a dex what build. Highcliff's blueprints. Who do I give them to? What's the problem with these blueprints? I don't really know what I do with them. Okay, my iron's up here. And that chest, I believe. Shadow <gasps> Heart, if you could be so kind. Let's see what my touch can do. There it is. 
is the infernal iron. Okay. And a steel forged sword. That I will never use. Infernal metal! This can help Damon patch up my engine. It sure can. You better believe we're going over there. Just let me read these notes first though. Specimen metal, hardness 9.5, very hard. Melting point, unknown. Color, silver. Markings, red lacerations, flecked with yellow dust. Source, underdark? Notes, gift from redacted. Faintly sulfuric odor. Forging unsuccessful. Will not melt or warp at standard temperature. Well, we better make sure we give that to Damon just so he's got all the information. I Thanks. I don't need a smoke powder barrel unless we're about to get into combat and I don't know it. Me. Okay. What have we got over here? Not a damn lot. I think it's just time to leave. Hold up. Do you think I can get up there? I don't think I can. It seems like a lot of effort to go to. You. Can you get up there? What's up here? Ah! Ah! Well, that's a bitch. Uh. Hmm. Y'all can't yet. jump that high. But there's definitely something up there. Carl, like, the can you just deal with this? It's just, it's killing me. Can it go there, please? We're gonna build us. Can we turn it a little bit? Thank you. Now, can you get up here? No, I don't. I'm, can you physically move? How do I get you to get up top there? Oh, well that's just cheating. <laughs> None of the others can get up here. Oh well, you may as well loot the skeleton while you're here, I suppose. Oh, well, now we don't need that. Oh, you do slashing as well! Son of a... You What's don't next? do slashing. Can you get up here? Time to meet your end. <laughs> Uh, she kind of just walked through it. That was weird. Whispering depths. Yeah, okay. I'm gonna need y'all to get your asses up here. Let's get going. This. <sighs> Guys, shut up! What the fuck are you doing? Your ass back up here. Oh, ah! Onward, ever onward. How did you get through? But they couldn't. Let's do this. I don't understand. Made it ready. How did she just go through it? That was weird. But okay, let's go. What path lies before me? All right. I don't know where we are. Those waves oh. are huge. Yeah, Tread I just realized where we were. This is not where we want to be. Oh no, these spiders kill us. <laughs> <laughs> 